I have a weird feeling that I forgot something. But I have no idea what it is. And I want to see if we can find ourselves a diamond here on Hirschfelden. Probably the animal or <laughs> the map where I got the least amounts of diamonds on. So we're heading out here. Basically, we are covered with integrity for all of the animals. Might as well just go for a bison. Let's see if we can actually get anything decent over there. And guys, if you want to join, there is now a Zaki Nation on Facebook as well. There is a link for that in the description below. Maybe one of the mods can post it as well. If you are on Facebook, I would love to see you in there. It's not going to be tied to one game. It's going to be tied to what we do on this channel. So I would love to see you in there. And I'm stuck behind a rock right here. Incentive, all of the above. Mask Grim, Frederikson Jones, Voxix, Silver Moon, Bolard Sisak, Tufelhunden, Epic Sunset Programmer, Platziage, Francisco Alpha Wolf, Tommy Richens, Vivian Albier, Henry Gobelar, Mark Luke, and David Mann. Thank you so much for stopping by so soon. Let's get that Diamond Milanist cigarette there. That could be a dream. I mean, that or a. I think, to be honest, a piebald wouldn't really hurt either because. Melanistic, they they look badass, but piebald is just I don't know. It really looks awesome as well, as long as it's not albino. Oh, got a roadie of some sorts down here. Might as well do a con check on that thing. At least it's dead. Thank you, mess. Hey, Goliath and Isaac. Do I sound tired? Mm, well, it, we had daylight savings today, so technically, in my mind, it's 10 o'clock, where it's only 9 o'clock. Um, <laughs> as per the real time. But we are back to winter time now, which is going to make it a little easier when I say CET instead of CEST. But yeah, I have had a busy weekend with my kid. I had tons of fun. Um, I love that kid. Luckily, better say that, but uh, <laughs> yeah, we just, we've been chilling and having so much fun and she's loving the new place and I'm loving the new place as well. I still haven't done too much about the Echo, so if there is a bit of reverb, I do apologize, but you're gonna have to bear with me, at least for now. Uh, been watching your videos since I started playing. Your tutorials were a huge help. Last night I got my first time at a 991 white tail. Thanks so much and keep up the great work. I'm so happy to be able to help you, Warren. Make sure to join us on Discord as well. There is a link for that in the description below. I would love if you would come and hang out with us. Welcome to the stream, guys. Don't forget to hit that like button. Hey, Avika. How are you? Been ages since I've seen you around. How is Maruk? Maruk. Magus, sorry. Too many RM guys these days. Um, Frederick G says hello from Sweden. Asgard is in the house as well, and he is actually wearing the big helmet of the sponsors, which is now actually members here on YouTube. Uh, a small little fellow, dear. Not really going to be worth running after. But if you also want one of those cool helmets next to your name, sign up as a sponsor. Or a member, as it is called now. There is a link for that in the description as well. And you'll get access to... Uh, I want to do more... Um, member specific things which is gonna be members only it might be members only live streams and such that's gonna be a thing at some point and um yeah I, I, you get access to the emote emotes and such as well so you do actually get some kind of value for your money as well as you get access access to the castle on discord the place where we hang out and have fun Luke, ryan voxies torra blixt what do you think is good uh, going to be weapon pack too. I don't know. I hope it's going to be some sort of muscle loader. Would love to see that. Where are we at? I don't want to run around here. I want to run around here. Is Dox on console yet? Yes, it is. I failed my diamond moves. Oh, that sucks, Togi. Actually, I want to change the time. Not happy with this being so late. There we go. This is better. Luca, Holly, what is up? Odin as well in the house. Yes, ages and it's also last time you see me, unfortunately. Why so, Avika? What's going on? Oh, is it that bad now these days? 
Jackson Beard is in the house as well. Make sure to go and check out his Red Dead Redemption 2 stuff. I must say that I do regret that I don't have my Xbox hooked up and I don't have the game yet because it looks so much fun. Which color for Buffalo? Um, there is no color for Buffaloes actually. I got my white cape buffalo. If you check out my channel, you can see my video. I might go check that out later, Tommy. No self-promotion though. Can you show your perks and skill points? I can take a quick look at that right here. This is my rifle points. Handguns. Shotguns. And archery. Feel free to go back in time and stop it if you would missed anything skills looks like this which is pretty much always what i use unless i'm really hunting the ducks and we are currently using the sack tactics as well if you could add one animal to the game what would it be let me ask you guys the same question what animal would you really like to see in the hunter call of the wild i mean the next one for me i would love to see turkeys on light and leg i would love to see pheasants here on Hirschfelden. I would love to see wolves added to the Medved Tiger. And maybe Eland for or Ellen. I don't know actually how that's pronounced, but that big deer species or antelope species on Bohonga Savannah. Class was squishy wants to see kangaroos. Goliath says next Saturday it's rifle season opening for white tailed deer. Best of luck to all you hunters out there. Too bad I can't reset my skills. Oh, that sucks. Um, can't wait for your stream Tuesday, Mr. Beard. Are you actually going to be streaming Red Dead? Are we going for um, for Call of the Wild, Beard? Has that been decided yet? Mrs. Beard is in the house as well. Thank you so much for stopping by. And Melon Popper brought wolfers along with him. And Jace Johnson says turkey, pheasants, All wolves, right. snuggies, and more waterfowl. Also squirrels. Turkey, mule deer, and pronghorn. Lions for Vohonga. Marcus is in the house as well. Nice to see your name pop up here as we just had a Vika here too. Call of the Wild still for Tuesday. Okay. Night Rocker, happy Sunday, everyone. Got my first diamond last night. 985 duck. Congratulations, Night Rocker. That first one is special. Just ask Mr. Beard how that one felt. I mean, I actually got my very first diamond right here on Hirschfelden. A 966 scoring red deer. Best locations for duck and geese? Um, I honestly can't tell you these days because they seem to have messed them up even more. But geese seems to be, any of the fields seems to work pretty well for me at least. And ducks, um, I actually do have pretty much luck wherever I find need zones. So I would go for that. Drayton, you haven't missed too much. Justin Crassley, what is up? I came, sh I came to thank you, Saggy, and also great community and for meeting all of you, unfortunately. My mental health does not let me enjoy the stream anymore. So it is my goodbye. Avika. You have been a part of this community for so long. I know you've been going through all kinds of serious stuff with your illness and everything. From the bottom of my heart, Avika. Thank you for all the time you've spent with us. It's going to be a huge loss not having you around anymore, but I do completely understand your decision. I'm getting all emotional. Avika, honestly, I love you, and I can pretty much speak from behalf of all the old school guys from the channel. We do talk about you quite often, we do think about you a lot, and we all wish you the very best moving forward i hope marcus is going to be able to stay in touch and at least give us a few updates once in a while best of luck my girl if you ever decide to give us a shot again we're all gonna be here we're all gonna have open arms for whenever if you should be ready <sighs> That was a serious turn this stream took all of a sudden. Got a dumb... Actually, Avika loves the road ears. Let's go and find ourselves a road ear. This one is for you, Avika. 
And yes, that hunter guy, what happened? Um, so far in the stream, not much happened. We did a single contact on a rodeo. And that's about it. And now we're just about to call in another one. I think we should be pretty good just sitting here. Dang it, Sax, making me all emotional. You're a good man with a big heart. Hmm, what is the best way to make money now that ducks are in smaller flocks? Well, that was quite a <laughs> unfortunate change of of, um, of path with the chat. But um, honestly, just go out and shoot whatever you see. Geese, if they still work as they used to, geese are still good money, but else just shoot whatever you see. If you want to hunt specific animals for a lot of money, I would advise you to go and check out some red deer hunting. Um, hey Saggy, this is my first live stream. Zach Bush, welcome to the stream then. I actually do have a... What's a decent size rose score? I actually don't remember. Andreas says, I have to hilse for good on a perfume. Well, say hello to them. I actually do miss playing with those guys. That was so fun. Uh, Andreas, if you haven't... S you were actually a part of the video, weren't you? I don't remember. We did make a a video or a live stream with... If, no, it was a video. With some of the people that I actually started playing the Hunter with back in... Uh, January last year sometime. Kelly, what is up? Where are bison? Um, all over the map over here seems to be really my hotspot for for the bison. She's right there. <laughs> she almost snuck up on us. Is she alone? She might be. She dead now though. And I didn't see anything. Run away. Sportsman Channel, doing pretty damn good. Had an amazing weekend with my daughter. And still working on that con check. <laughs> yeah, Asgard is actually watching the Formula 1 as well today. He was like, yeah, I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to make it. Oh, 30 kilos? That could be a big one. Um. Yeah. Thank you guys so much for all the well wishes for Avika. It really means the world to me. Chuck Tukowski is asking, what gun are you using? I've been using the 7mm. The 7mm is my favorite rifle. For this hunt in particular, I brought the 223 for Fox, the 7mm for Red Deer and Bison, 243 for Fallow Deer and Roe Deer, and the 44 for the... What is that called? Wild Boris. <laughs> How's the little lady doing? She is loving her big room. Um, we moved to a new apartment and she has like a ginormous room. I mean, I mean, not ginormous, but compared to what you would expect a two-year-old to have. Almost three-year-old. And, oh my god. That feeling you get when she's so happy and just mess all everything, uh, empty every of the boxes out on the floor and you're just being like... Oh man, I should have I should have not given her a big room. But Yeah. <laughs> it's now in the past, so it's going to be all fun and games to clean that up later. But she's sleeping and we've had a phenomenal weekend. She's just loving the new place and we've been out playing on the playgrounds and everything, so really loving it. Candy plus saggy Stream best combo ever. What is your dream diamond now that you have your red deer? Mm, either a melanistic diamond elk or a piebald red deer. Maybe melanistic red deer. I don't know. One of those. That could be like really cool to get. Mm. Yeah, they're getting big way too fast. That is true. Gonna continue running for a bit. <sighs> oh. Did I hear something over here? Not sure I did. Can you let Flinder know I'm mad on him for leaving us on such a cliffhanger with yesterday's video for his? <laughs> Drayton, I didn't even, I actually didn't even watch Flinter's latest video, so 
I am totally in the dark with that one. Was he springbok hunting, I think? I don't know. Don't remember. Where do you live now, Zagi? Um, not that far away to where I lived before, so... Wasn't a far move or anything. But still on Fyn. Got another road here. Maybe Avika just blessed us with a bunch of roadies for this stream. Greet all the old faces from me, Zaki, and I also greet you all. Oh, thank you very much. I'm still on Facebook and Steam, though. If anything important, there is always a way to contact me. Also through Marcus. That is awesome to know, Avika. Avika, make sure to join the uh, Sega Nation on Facebook as well, then. If you're not already is in it, there is a link for that in the description below. Or just go to facebook.com slash groups slash Zaki Nation. Chased one with a huge super chat. Thank you so much, Chased one. Okay, I'm late seeing any beavers. They seem to be getting scarce. I actually haven't had any beaver issues for quite a while now that you mention it, which is um, which is surprising. Everything else seems to be breaking in this game these days. Uh, at least when it comes to the consoles, after they got the docks, they just have had so many issues, and I feel so sorry for you guys. But Chased One, thank you so much for your generosity, my man. You are insane. Can still remember my two girls as babies, and now I have two grandkids. L O L. <laughs> Time goes by way too fast, eh, Asgard? I love the fact that Saggy is on Facebook. Yeah, I actually do use it quite a bit. Bit. Mostly these. Oh, that might be a gold fellow deer. Gonna have to go and check that out. Matthew Fournier, what is up? Oh, Tuffelhunden actually had one smash attempt a couple of days ago. So the beavers are still in play. And chased one. Let me know which animal would you like to see introduced for hunting purposes next in the Hunter Call of the Wild? I think I know the answer. <laughs> Bye, Zaggy. I will go to bed now. I have to stay up at 5 to feed the piglets. Andreas, thank you so much for stopping by, my man. I really appreciate it. Also, you, make sure to join the Second Nation on Facebook, my man. Is it true that if you kill more males on your map, that more males will appear each time you go on it? Um, the th Oh, I just spooked him. Dang it. The theory we have is... If you actually kill an animal, something similar, maybe a little bigger, maybe a little smaller, or equal, will spawn. So, yeah. I actually don't know if you can get the... You probably can get the females to become males somehow. I, I actually... Honestly, I can't tell you, like, the specific things behind it, because no one has told us. Melon Papa wants to be current sheep. That hunter guy just shot a diamond. Nice. He did look like a level 4, this guy running off. I have no idea what that means, CT Boar, but thank you so much for being here. A proper kudu. Eh, the lesser kudu is, is nice. I mean, honestly, I would rather have something else than having a big kudu and a small kudu. wonder if we can actually call this guy in somewhere. Hmm. Silver Moon, I have never called you Crazy Cat Lady. Why would you call Silver Moon Crazy Cat Lady? Just because she's crazy and has a few cats? <laughs> Alright, because I'm seeing... All I'm seeing right now on Layton is three very easy moves. No forest and no two minor. Keep shooting them, Jace! Or if you really want, you can always do a... If you're playing on PC, that is, you can always go and... Well, you can actually do that on all of the uh, consoles as well. Just go server hub a bit and have a bit of fun on the different... Ooh, that is level 4. I'm gonna have to take a shot that I really don't want to take here. That was way too close. A good looking one, but go jump on random multiplayer servers and steal all their need zones and have more spawns of the particular animals and just make it 
have a bit of fun on the other ones as well. It is only a silver. Wow. I thought he would be gold for sure. Hmm. Joachim Janssen, what is up? John Tollens is dead. Hey, 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 everyone. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons for this great man. Enjoy the stream and keep it clean. Mrs. B keeping up with the house rules. <sighs> How many of you guys in the chat right now are actually playing or are planning on playing Red Dead Redemption? I know it's not out on PC yet and I... Guys, I have a pretty, li pretty large Call of the Wild Facebook group and all we see these days is just... Red Dead Redemption stuff. <laughs> Jamie Dixon, hey Zach DK. This is the first time I've watched one of your streams. Well, welcome to the live stream, Jamie. I am so happy to have you here. I'm not crazy, Saggy. I'm clumsy. We can call it that as well, Silver. It's okay. <laughs> Sportsman Channel says, Hmm, done everything for the day and it's 4.30. Sounds like beer or clog. Tufelhunden says, Red Dead 2 is on my list down the road. Too much on my plate at this moment. Yeah, I got so much stuff going on in my real life these days as well with the move. And I got some other real life stuff that I really need to take care of at some point as well. Um, hopefully it's all going to work itself out. And from Friday, I'm actually going to be off work for the year. So hopefully I will get this reverb sound <laughs> problems I have at the apartment fixed and then get time to actually do a lot more videos and I want to bring in so many new things to the channel as well. I made a long post in the Second Nation Facebook group as well as on my Patreon page. So if you are on Patreon, yes, I know I've shared the post somewhere else as well, but I'm just giving a little to the people who want to join on Facebook as well. Don't expect me to go around and do stuff like that all the time though you patreons and <clears throat> sorry and twitch subs and youtube members you do deserve to get all oh, all the goodies it's a female don't really want to waste too much time would it just be if we could see it somewhere do we just have a spot animal we did a four. Not really gonna be anything interesting, but um, do some shoesting. Where is it? I'm gonna hit a tree. Yeah, rather do a bit of calling and then have her get a little bit closer. You and Flinter should do another stream. I actually asked Flinter earlier today in his Discord if he wanted to go stream with me on the Hunter Classic for some werewolf hunting, but then um, he said no. Where is he? Where is she? Get out here, you dumb fucks. Crystal Whiting is in the house as well as Elite Hunter 457. Thank you for stopping by, guys. I remember the argument you two had. Scalia Paul, Povi, bye bye, Zaya. I need to go to bed, but on the next stream, can you hunt on Leighton? Um, no promises, but. Um, would imagine Leighton would be a good choice because we've been on Bohanka and Medved and now he's felt in lately. Are you really gonna stop behind a tree? You just don't like me, do you? Just got back from hunting real life. What did I miss? Um, not really too much interesting in the game. We had a 798 scoring fallow deer. Where is this in? Oh, she's right there. Why did I try to shoot it in the face? Okay. I don't like fun and games with foxes. Why did I waste so much time trying to actually get a decent shot and then I just end up missing everything up? 
Oh, zero info 300 does not work. Flinter won't stream with Saggy anymore. Flinter isn't on his diamond pipe level, so he makes excuses to avoid Saggy streams. Sportsman Channel. I agree. He's just so jealous. But my rare diamond is bigger scoring than his. And then he claims to have two, like I do, so. King James, what is up, Saggy? What did I miss? At work and just saw you was live. I've missed you. Aww. Look at that, completely butchered this thing. Twice hit it with the 223. Wasted so much ammo. Uh, King James, we missed you as well. Thank you so much for stopping by, but honestly, haven't missed too much. Remember on Flinter's 40k stream, I said, Flinter, the only reason you have friends is because of clickbait. <laughs> oh, you guys are roasting Flinter and he's not even here. Do we have a dislike on the stream yet? Flinter, are you here? Jared, what is up? So far we really haven't had much interesting stuff going on here. Should really run into some bison at some point. Yeah, and I have a thousand scoring duck. And a 998 scoring piebald duck. But let's not get into formalities, right? Only thing that counts is my biggest rare deer species. Or things with antlers or horns is still bigger than his biggest scoring one. <laughs> Lock me life, what is up? <laughs> There's one dislike Flinter went ninja. He surely did. It's always Flinter leaving that dislike. Oh, we actually got a red deer. Oh, nice little one as well. Can we call him back in here? They got a female piebald today and I got the DLC yesterday. Nice one. Where did he go? Is he gonna come back? As far as I know, Zaggy Flinter has a considerable amount of dino diamonds more than you and two real rare diamonds. Nah, Mid the Millen is the Kuda, I'm not gonna give him that. We have no actual proof. It was a level 5, yes, but it was still a Millenistic. And with the amount of bugs we have had with the Millenistic Kudos, I'm not giving him credit for that. And yes, he has more diamonds than me, but have you paid attention to the amount of hours he has more in the game than I do. Do you know when your next stream is gonna be? I might be streaming a little more on Twitch this week, so if you're not following me over there already, make sure to go ahead and do so. Else, join Discord and you will be notified when I go live. Actually, pretty decent. You can just keep moving. I don't know why I even did that. I <sighs> should go down. Got Twitch Prime finally. Never have subbed on Twitch. You've got a Prime sub waiting on you. King Games, I am so happy to hear that. And that will also put you into the exclusive yellow name club on Discord. So you get access to the night chat and the night hangout. I have a thousand scoring diamond dog as well. I got it on the day you uploaded the video of yours. <laughs> Am I the only one who f at first mistake Flint's YouTube channel for cheap comedy shows and actual hunting content? <laughs> oh, sportsman channel, I love you. Should get some... Uh, not gonna be a gold, but... So my dream diamond was a fallow deer for the past three weeks I've played his felon and got two level five, 943, 944, 943 bison, 944 level nine red deer, one 930 fox. Ooh, some more calling. And just three minutes ago I got a 970 fallow deer. Congratulations Arlie Snyder, I really want a 
diamond fallow deer as well. Everyone hit the like. Do it with two hands if you gotta. I really need to get that sound clip working again so I can have beard in my PC. <laughs> Flint ain't here to defend himself. Well, Flinter has a whole army of people attacking me whenever I set foot in his Discord. I think they will be fine for us while Silver. I really wonder if it's actually gonna come down here. I don't think it is with this steep hill in front of us. But it was a male warning call from a red deer. Oh, I just... It's been a while since I've had a 9 legendary red deer. But just look at it. This is not a big male and it still looks amazing. Oh, same size. Maybe even smaller. Yeah, not gonna waste too much time trying to line up anything perfect for him. Should be long. Don't ignore the truth, Saggy. Flinter will always be better hunter in game and in real life, obviously. Yeah, he spent so many more years than me to do it. It's okay. He's been playing since like very early hunter. I got so many hours into the game. It would be sad if I was better than him. But I still have the biggest rare diamond. <laughs> Meh, Flinter can take it. Like Saggy said, he basically hides behind his kid army in Discord. Uh, yeah, we really should bring back the Flinter... Team Flinter versus Saganation thing, but actually bring it to real games as well, where it's not just gonna be about hunting. <laughs> my grandpa is trying to steal my money. Helps! I kind of feel bad for you, Saggy, when everyone attacks you in his stream and Discord. That's okay. As I also mentioned before, as long as people go to links to actually hate me, that means that I stay in their consciousness. It would be so much worse if they didn't know who I was. Sandra is in the house. Guys, if you haven't already checked it out, I shared one of Sandra's latest videos from her gaming channel on my community tab lately with <laughs> us playing a bit of golf it. Um, I hate the game. I didn't win. But it was tons of fun, and you really should go and check out that video at some point after the stream. Dan Ethan is in the house as well. I haven't joined a Sunday stream in ages. Well, you're here now, man. Guys, if you haven't yet hit the subscribe button, and I see I've actually missed one. Gitush Nitzan subscribed 26 minutes ago. I'm so sorry I didn't give you a shout out. I might just have been completely afraid of messing up your name. What is your time zone, Zaggy? C E T. <laughs> Turtle Hunting says, got it. The next stream, Zaggy versus Flinter. Hunter Call of the Wild rap battle with guest appearance by Jaxie Beard. Yeah, I could make that work. Why am I walking up here? Is there actually anything up here? There is! We could have just fast traveled over there though. We're gonna do parkour for a little... Let's go! It's 9.35pm here in Denmark. It is! God damn it! I'm too fat. I'm asking for it now. <laughs> Lock Me Life has subscribed to Sandra. Guys, if you're into K-pop, um, and in particular K-pop reactions made by a beautiful Norwegian girl, check out Sandra Linnea's channel. Of course, after the stream. What a stream that would be. <laughs> Wolfo says, one dislike, who, what, why, when. Um, why? Because Flinter doesn't like me. When? When Flinter was around. Who? Flinter? What? I don't know. He just doesn't like me anymore. Might be because he, he can't get real big scoring rare diamonds like me. I don't know. 
<laughs> it seems like Denmark is an hour ahead of me, Cass. I'm in Ireland and it's 8.36. Yes! We just had daylight savings today. So now it actually gets dark around 5 p.m. And I'm loving it. Oh. Sportsman Channel says, I went cheap today. I bought Molson Dry. We need to get a few drinking stream streams back again at some point as well. Beard and Mrs. B would probably agree that that would be a fun thing to have going on again. If you have missed it for my birthday, I actually got invited on Jaxie Beard's late, late, late night stream. I was off work. Or... Oh my god, I'm dying here. I hadn't started work for the year yet when I had my birthday back in April and I ended up thinking it was a good idea taking a shot of whiskey every time Beard got a donation. Unfortunately people do have a lot of one dollar donations going on for that. Turned out to be not my best decision I've ever made. Ooh. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. It's a seven. I think. Shout out to the April babies. Where is he? There was a bigger one. It's definitely a bigger one. That is a seven. Anything moving over there? No. I only see two sets of antlers. It was a great idea. I've actually promised Buddha to do one before the end of the year. So I have to... I think we can see everything going on over there now. And I do believe the level 7 red deer is probably the biggest one of them. I don't want to take the shot just yet, because we might, if we're like extremely lucky, have another one hiding in the bushes somewhere. And I'm gonna see if I can make it all the way down to that bush. Down there. They're stalking me. They're just looking at me. Taggy, you must have been in a good state by the end of the stream. Good times. I, honestly, I don't even think I remember the end of the stream. <laughs> it was fun. I've actually never went back to rewatch it just because I am afraid of what I might have done or said or... I felt so bad for Rek Kiwi because he was just... <laughs> I just completely took over that stream. Flint is watching football with his parents and he all roasting him behind his back. Well, he can always go back and watch the replay of the stream, so not feeling too bad. I'm not gonna make it all the way down there, which is okay, because we can't really see anything particularly special. The guy seems to be the biggest one. What was that shot? Damn it, hit another one. How did I flesh wound that? That's a road here. It's not gonna shoot you. Might just shoot at you at this point. How did I flesh wound that though? I didn't. What? Why didn't it drop any bit of life? Huh, weird. Then uh, just dropped an eight mythical red deer with the twin gauge. That is nice. Oh, something is dead over here. Oh, it's him. Did I spot the wrong one or something? 
Ah. <laughs> Second scoring 798 animal of the stream so far. <sighs> I'm not taking sh shots for subs anymore, Zaggy. My liver hates me as much as Flintus has kids standing for him. Oh, the road deer is dead over there. Chico is in the house as well. When they did the mini pets on console, they spawned reset and I had a 35 kilo row and a 9 red deer. Nice. Oh, I don't know anything about that, Silver Moon. I don't think I've ever heard anything about that. Mark Luger wants me to kill ducks. No. He is answering Gonex Hunter. How do you get money fast? Kill ducks. Ducks are keys. Seems to still be the way to go, to be quite honest. But else, red deer hunting is really nice money as well. Um, if you have a powerful weapon, you could go on... Um, what's called? Yeah, what is it called? Wohonga. And have a bit of long range shooting and see if you can get a few herds of animals because if you can get like wildebeest out on a, a far distance and you can plow down a few of those then you're actually making yourself a lot of money as well time to go to the range <laughs> well the shooting wasn't too bad i should just not go for the for the lungs and the red deers with this gun so much easier with the 454 don't know why i didn't bring that instead of the three, uh, 7 mm I really should have. Ooh. I got my thousand, thousand. Well, I can't say that. Thousands gold today. Congratulations, Demi. Clanky Wonky Jaming. What is up? Thank you for stopping by. Big Baba is in the house as well. I'm gonna go for a quick run and then turn north. Oh. I actually got a mating call from a bison. That might be interesting then. That's three very easy. It's better down right there in front of us as well. Is that it? Oh no, there's more out here. Another level three. Oh, there's the herd. Can't really see anything special. Are you gonna get farming sim 19? I've pre-ordered it at least. How much I'm gonna be playing it, I don't know. There's so much hype about it, I need to go and check what it is. How many of you guys are going to be playing Farming Sim 19 when that comes out in November? Like, there's some pretty decent horns right there, I think. Just a bummer that I can't really get to spot it. I'm wondering if I should go up or go down. Another three, very easy. There's actually a big herd right here. Oh, 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 oh. Wind is gonna be an issue now. I might pick it up, it's gonna be my first farming sim game. So everyone, what is your ooh, favorite game to spend your spare time on lately, Mrs. Beard asks in the chat. And I'm just going to ask the exact same question. What is the game you're playing these days? Myself, I've been playing um, quite a bit of Counter-Strike again. I don't know why I've all of a sudden fallen back into that habit. Do really enjoy it. A bit of PUBG. And then I'm just waiting to see what's going to... What's going to really spike my interest now when we get closer to me being off work and everything? Is it possible for a very easy animal to be Diamond Gunnex Hunter? Yes, it is indeed. Road Deer and Whitetails, for example, doesn't get any bigger than level 3. So, yeah. Also, if you really want to know everything about the animals and what you need to know to actually get a Diamond Animal, 
join the discord on there there is a link to the spreadsheet which you really do not want to be missing out on it got all the info on all the animals what kind of weight you need to look at if you're hunting for the diamonds and well what level what weapons and all that kind of jazz big bubber playing red dead redemption the isle for sandra dauntless for incentive sandra wants farming sim 19 too that's just because there's a horse in there Silver Hunter says, Stellaris, I'm slowly conquering the galaxy. Mrs. B is still playing Call of the Wild, she needs to get to level 60. For now, it's Call of Duty Black Ops 4 and CSGO for Mark Lugge. I'm gonna be in a world of trouble in just a bit. Hi, the Ace. And War Bloody is in the house as well. Gonna see if we can get close enough without getting run over by a heavy cow. The ace says farming sim 19 for sure. I am very, very close to that thing over there. Don't want him being mad at me. Oh my... You were a little closer than I first anticipated. I do expect all the big ones to have run off by now. Oh! Get some quick spots. Yeah, nothing major. <gasps> what? Oh, 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 that one's out to get me. What was that jump? What were... Enough with the 7mm bull stuff here, guys. We got some serious issues with these bisons right here. I'm gonna put that thing right back in here. That is not working out great for me today. And then we are bringing out the big one. Teleporting bison, yeah. Like, what the hell was that? None of them died, apparently. Well, one of them has to have died. Where did we die? Over there? I think we did. <laughs> A little glitchy. Who would have thought? Put on some bullets for this one. I need to stock up on bullets soon. I'm really starting to run low. See ya, Mark. Mahmoud Al Hassan. Thank you so much for stopping by. <laughs> I thought you were a gunner there. Is Eid bonus worth 166? Yes, 166.67. Or 666666666. 7, I think. Where's the best place to aim with the 4570 for Moose and Call of the Wild? Uh, either go for the double spine or the heart would be my advice. Wow, Sandra is saying it's not it's not the gun's fault. If I've had my machine fail on me without me being at fault. Yeah, I don't like the new 470 Nitro for Bison. I actually don't. I haven't used that gun for so long. I, I just really don't enjoy it. The, the only thing good about the 470 is the... Is honestly the boom. That's pretty much the only thing that I really, really, really like about the gun. 
Anything else? I prefer the 338, to be honest. How many of you guys are actually actively using the 470 still? Jacob Grizzle says, I've been watching Flinter and found you through him. I sobbed. Thank you so much for subscribing and make sure to join us on Discord as well, Jacob. Welcome to the Sega Nation. Oh, <laughs> it's 470. I was way off. You were a sportsman channel. I just didn't want to point that out. I only use the 7mm for big game. Have this. I don't know. I don't want to do all those spine shots that I always do. And if I'm going longs or anything, I just like the penetration so much more of the 45, 70. Oh, no. Wow. The 454. Sorry. Messing things up here. Did I even bring first aid kits? No. I didn't. All guns can shoot, but not all shooters can shoot. It's not the gun, it's the guy behind it. Shut up, Melon. My guns are firing blanks these days. <laughs> uh, Chased One is only using the 470 for beavers. <laughs> oh, nice, Jacob. Mahmoudul doesn't use the 470. <laughs> Sportsman channel is on to it. Ja Jacob Grizzle, happy Flintus channel, brought you to the better guy. It's so sad that Flinter doesn't watch my stuff. He, he has no idea how much we actually roast him, guys. Leon Benjak is in the house as well. At least my stream doesn't seem to go offline every other minute like Flinters has been lately. Still really weird. Got a mating goal from Bison down there. Let's open find this thing. <laughs> Flinter needs to upload more like you. Well, Flinter uploads every day. I've been pretty much only doing streams lately. Due to some real life circumstances, which hopefully will be resolved at some point soon. Where's my bison? Over there. Big Baba's gonna go cook dinner. See y'all later. See ya, Big Baba. Thank you so much for stopping by. Wow. I was like... <laughs> I was sure it was... I'm so bad with this time zone changing. I was sure that I would be ending the stream somewhat soon, but... Um, we got another hour to go, guys. We're, we're actually just getting started. What, card, what type of graphic card do you have? I am running a MSI GTX 1070 Ti. Why do you stream so late, Saggy? Because I need my daughter to sleep before I can stream. So, very, very easy to answer that question. Hamilton is world champion once again. And if you don't know what we're talking about, it is the Formula 1 championship. 7mm is the way too good for all the big game animals. Yeah, if you shoot them right. Not a bad shot like me. Is Mrs. Beard, Jaxie Beard's wife? Huh. Are you Mrs. B? I don't know if we have had any confirmation that you are the only thing you do is you keep deleting all his harley photos in general of the barbershop other than that i don't know but yes the it is the beard's wife which i still owe a coffee date at some point <laughs> yes second the time change messed me up you started 1 p.m pst now oh nice Zaggy and Jaxi are the guys on Call of the Wild. Oh, thank you. Yeah, it's really not going to be worth tracking any of these. We have had no big tracks from any of them. And uh, to be quite honest, I'd rather just go north into... Really? 
that's why I love the 454. I'm gonna hide behind this tree. You die right there, please. Because stuff actually dies when you shoot it. No, 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 no. What is up with this game? Why is everything trying to kill me? You're going down. I think. I don't know. Did I hit it? Oh, this one died in a standing position. I don't know if I really care. I really want to take pictures when they die like this. But I don't dare when everything is out to get me like this. Look at this. The 7mm. Pelvis only. Oh, we did shoot it in the butt. And I'm shooting with the 44. Jesus Christ. I'm shooting with the wrong gun. <laughs> this is the gun that I wanted to shoot with. I need to change that because this key is always my... There we go. No more mistakes to be made. This is all my waste my 454. <sighs> I can't believe it died so fast of just getting shot with the 44 though. Although we did shoot it with the 7mm first, so that's the thing. This one was heard when it ran off. But I don't know if it has been heard from before? Or... We actually managed to hit it this time. I think it's probably been heard from before then. Hmm. Yeah, at least I'm not gonna spend too much time trying to track down a wounded female bison. Definitely not worth it. Well, thanks. we have two kids together and live in the same house. Wouldn't do that with just anyone. Uh. I mean, it's the beard. Who wouldn't want to live with the beard? When do you come on live i mean what day of the week and what time mahmoudul it's always 9 p.m central european time on sundays and if you don't want to miss any of the other random streams that i tend to do make sure to join us on discord as well where i will be posting every time i go live and this is not north this is north what did the dad buffalo say to his son before he went to <laughs> to school Bye, son. Elk the Gamer hitting us with the dad jokes right there. Do you think for a $700 PC build this game could run at good FPS? Ah, I would have to ask some of my American friends about that. I don't know the prices in American currency or in dollars for what a decent PC capable of running the Hunter Call of the Wild would, but I would imagine you would be somewhat close. You would probably be running it in like minimum or something, but you should be able to get like a 1060 or something for a $700 PC. But uh, hopefully some of the tech savvy guys in the chat can help us out right there. Uh, John Tolan is asking, what time is it there, bro? It's 9pm here in Motherwell, Scotland. Right here in Denmark. It is now 10, or actually 1 minute past 10 at night. Morning call from a female fox. Spent too much time on those already. With a GTX 1060 you could. My cat just touched my nose because I'm not paying any attention to her it's official silver moon you are now the crazy cat lady of this community you and chakti with medium high settings at 1080p thank you so much dimi kitten says 700 dollars would run the game okay but you wouldn't be able to jack up the settings much higher than low to get 45 fps 
Ish. Yeah, I had a 10. Uh, I had a 1060 in my old PC, and that actually was somewhat okay. It did struggle a little when I streamed. King Fabi, what is up? Check this out. Just now. You know, I'm in like defensive mode when I'm just running around with my handgun out all the time. Dash button movement? No, I'm just, I'm just seeing things. I still want to go up here. You should like place waypoints or something because I'm just spending so much time running in the wrong direction here. Any Canadians in the stream aside from me and Mrs. Beard, the Sportsman channel asks, and let me just ask everyone, where in the world are you watching from? I'm streaming right out of Denmark little country in the northern part of Europe but let me know if you want to drop your state your city or your country maybe even all three of them and we'll see where and just how far around the world we reach in this community Mrs. B from PC Canada Swansea Wales for Matt Brace Kalle from Sweden do you know? I don't know that Luku Bora. Um, U.S. Omaha, Nebraska, Newfoundland, Canada. Well, I'm not Canadian, but I wish I was. <laughs> Chase one from Cal Alaska. Zach Keller is actually from British Columbia, Canada as well. Be careful! You're not running into the beard one day then. El the gamer from Wyoming. MSR is from Brazil. Silver Moon from Oregon. U.S. Florida from Night Rocker, Kitten from Weston, Colorado. It's all the animals. Give me animals. Zach Keller is actually from Vancouver Island, so running into the beards might actually be a very possible scenario at one point. It's just about to do the same mistake that I didn't want to do. Get down, you dumb bison. Class with Squishy missed so much of the stream. Well, good news. We still got 55 minutes to go, my man. James Fordham from Ontario, Canada. A lot of folk from around the world. Hey, guys and gals. Henry Grobbler is watching from Zambia. Yeah, thing is, you can't shoot them when they're not on their way down. I like to scare them. It's official, I'm the lone wolf of the community, Saggy. Well, you are the crazy cat lady. Look at that. I actually hit it in the thoracic spine with the first one and it still ran a little. Can't believe we still haven't got a single gold scoring animal. Wolfus is watching from The Hague, Netherlands. Lukobora, thank you so much and right back at you. And basically everyone, thank you so much for spending your Sunday night, Monday morning or Sunday afternoon with me right here on this lovely little place called YouTube. Make sure to subscribe if you are new to the channel though and join us on Discord. Ooh. The fox call. So now it's actually official. We know what the fox say. Well, Gabor says you can actually kill views in the air, but it's very hard to estimate the distance. Is that the track of him? Might be. Ten to thirteen. Not ten point three. Yep, not a big one. I 
I have no idea, Lukubora, what that means. I don't speak that. That didn't work. Whenever it's not big animals, I just never give it the time. How did we not hit anything? Matt Bray says, I had a dream hunt this afternoon after watching your tips from an earlier video. That is awesome. Matt Brace, what did you get? The hell? I know the last one didn't hit, but I really did, did expect the first one to do it. No, Luko Boda, whenever I don't know what something means, I'm not gonna pronounce, try to pronounce it, unfortunately. We might have a rifle here that can take care of it. Although I do really want to see if we can kill it with the 223. Simply just because it probably is going to be a gold then. I need my um, breath back. There we go. When you actually try to be a little bit patient in this game. Sometimes it actually do pay off. <laughs> Sounds like Saggy got to do a meetup in British Columbia. Uh, if I ever got invited over there, might be a thing. Is the 22 good for Coyote and Fox? No, definitely not. Don't use that. And it is actually the first gold of the stream. Lovely coloration on this Fox as well. Very much enjoying that. Um, use the 243 for coyotes and the 223 for foxes. Had numerous moose, few rosewold elks, loads of whitetail and a blacktail. And my first bison. Seems like you've been hunting both maps then. Don't start, Saggy. The invite has happened more than once. You just don't like us enough, enough to come, I guess. That's not true. It's just... Flying and such is, is expensive and taking time off and... Oh, so many excuses, Mrs. B. Come on, Saggy, just go. <laughs> I, I have some... I want to go at some point soon, but... I really do have some serious stuff going on in my real life I need to figure out first and then I need to get this YouTube stuff back on track and hopefully grow the channel with a few new games which I still don't really know what's gonna be but we're definitely gonna find something that I'm gonna enjoy playing and hopefully you're gonna be enjoying watching it as well um, I wanna go to Canada it's been on my bucket list for ages my parents was actually there last year and uh, brought me home a bottle of whiskey. So sad to see we have so many small... Oh, we don't have that much life that I want to spare it falling down like that. I'm kind of bummed to see that we only have small red deers around here. Life gets in the way, Zeki DK. It really does sometimes, but um, wouldn't be fun if there wasn't struggles along the way, would it? Do you think Call of the Wild will get a Halloween update? No, I'm pretty sure they actually said somewhere that they were not going to do it this year. People here from everywhere, yet I'm the only one from Quebec, says the Sportsman Channel. I love all of your vid sags and beards and flinters and the rest of the community. That is awesome. We'd love to have you in the community, Elk the Gamer. I've actually missed hunting. Here's Felton. I 
Where does my red deer herd though? I nearly always have a big red deer herd up here somewhere. See if we can find it. Boon the man and Elias is in the house. Thank you so much for stopping by. <laughs> we would all be very boring if we didn't face struggles to develop our characters right. Yeah. Let's just turn it into a council in session with about life and stuff like that. Guys, if you have any problems with your real life right now, I am sure Mrs. B and I would be able to help you out very much. So if you have anything you would like to share, let's see what we can do and make it all a happy place for everyone to be. Cookie Jar <laughs> is in the house. Where is it? I want to have tracks up here at least, and there is just nothing. Seriously? Nothing? We can't just have that level 5 down there. <laughs> James Carras says, No offense, but I come here to get away from real life, not to talk about it. Yeah. It's my getaway as well, James. Man, this chat would be so boring if we didn't have Flinter to make fun of. Yeah, I, I think it's it's like mutual. Flinter's chat would be boring if he couldn't make fun of me, and my chat would be boring if we couldn't make fun of Flinter. <laughs> Our biggest problem is you, Zaggy. Wow, Sandra. Did you just low-key call me fat? Where the hell is my red deer? I'm gonna try something here. Kelly, good night. ZZ Angora says, Zaggy, you are cool, man. There we go. I had a feeling they might be down here. I wonder if Flinter will ever get a rare bison classic. No, probably not. Is Denmark good at any sport? No offense. Um. I think we're pretty... I, I think we gotta be like one of the best... Uh, what is that called? Isn't it just called badminton in... In English as well? When it comes to like Olympic disciplines and such. But other than that, I don't think we're good at anything. To be quite honest. Where are the diamonds? Henry, I think Juan stole them all. It's not a diamond, but... Uh, He'll do, and with us doing the fast travel, Kansek is probably gonna be off. But it's okay. We just got ourselves another level 7 red deer. Oh, and handball as well. Heavy Critic says handball too. <laughs> You're taking a good roast tonight. Yeah, I mean, if... Oh, our consecutive didn't actually fall off. That's interesting. If I... Didn't... I, I don't say that I want people to roast me or anything, but if I couldn't handle hate and criticism and such, trying to be a public figure and putting myself out there with all my flaws and all everything that I've got going on in my life, I would really have... <laughs> I would have taken a wrong choice about doing YouTube. There's so many trolls out there. There's so many people trying to get you down. And Well, I can't save the world, but I can sure as hell try to make it a better place for all of the people who actually likes what we do here. Another level 6 fox, I think? Uh, is it... I think it might be running... No, it's going the other way. 
I want to go this way though. Because that should be pretty much in the path of what I expect our red is to be. Oh, is that a bison butt? No. That was a stone. Denmark is good at <laughs> soccer, Zaggy. Uh, yeah, in 1992 we were. Wayne is in the house and Aaron Fulkerson as well. Little late. I would like to know how many deaths to bacon there has been. Not any deaths to bacon. But we've been killed to beef. Yeah, we actually do have Christian Eriksen. That is right. And one good tennis player. Saggy, I'll explain how a Canadian trip works for... Um, if you do ever consider coming, you'll freeze your behind half of the time, spend the other half complaining about the cold. <laughs> uh. Morton Mumson says, handball, badminton, and quite decent football nation team if you compare it to the amount of people in Denmark. That is the thing, because we only got like nearly 6 million people, in, or 6 million Danish people, I think. I, I might be wrong, that's just rough estimate. But it's hard to gather 23 good players to play f soccer or all that kind of stuff. We have to be good at individual sports. And we're really not shining too much in that either. Mass Terkilsen is in the house. Welcome back, Mass. Say the piggy thing in Flinter Stream. No, I've said that once. It's good enough to just stay in Flinters. And we actually shot it with the correct gun as well. I am the best at being bad. Says Sandra. That, that wasn't me, by the way. That was Sandra. Sandra said that. That wasn't me. Flesh, thoracic, spine, and left lung. Dead fox. What? Morning call from a road here. So cold where I am, they don't supply... They don't supply ninjas with swords. They just find the biggest icicles. <laughs> just remember to no, never go AFK with Flinter. No, Flinter wouldn't do that to me. I'm a nice guy, you know. Where am I red deer? I'm, I'm seriously gonna kill someone if... If I don't find a red deer soon. Yeah, what is... Guys, if you have like one big thing... Or actually list the top three of the biggest sports in your area. Like in Denmark, I would say it would be soccer. Then I actually don't know, handball maybe? And as it is right now, then either tennis or Formula One as the third big thing would be my guess. Because we have Kevin Mounison in Formula One and Caroline, Caroline Wozniacki in tennis, which is somewhat talked about once in a while. But th that's about it when it comes to Danish sports, pretty much. If I am not too far behind in everything. Um, Sandra actually played handball when she was little. I thought you were tiny still, Sandra. When did you grow up? When I kick a football <laughs> at the net, it goes in the different direction. I was actually pretty decent at soccer. My only issue was that I was lazy. I had a killer shot, but I, I just... <sighs> Free kicks and everything. I always get to shoot. Corners as well, but... <laughs> I just did not want to run at all. Hockey, soccer, and snow stuff. Hockey, soccer, and football. American is football and baseball. I would say NBA as well, probably. By Atlan, hockey, and football? 
for Norway. Sandra is a huge Sparta fan, by the way. If you, any of you guys are supporting Norwegian ice hockey teams. So I don't know who the fierce rivals of the Spartans are, but... Go start some rivalry. Tim Dixon says it's probably rugby and football here in the UK. Sparta Dogs is American football, baseball, and I guess basketball. This town is just football and baseball. LOL. What about sailing and rowing and badminton? Yeah, but do we hear much about that? We never hear anything. Well, we do hear a little about rowing, but sailing? I actually have, like, one of my cousins is, like, a... I don't know. Something in the sailing sport in Denmark and is pretty darn good at it. Elias Tien says, Manchester United is the best. That is actually a statement I can agree with. Not this season, though. Damn, we are not good this season. But at least Mass is happy. Hockey, soccer, and volleyball, volleyball race swimming Olympics. Two. We call it football because you use the foot to move the ball. <laughs> that is a very, very precise explanation of the, <laughs> the term soccer to an American. Why we call it football? Hmm. Doesn't look like we're going to have any diamond right deers today. Elk the Gamer used to play soccer slash football until he got a concussion. Celtic FC in Scotland. Oh, I remember as a kid watching the old firm. That was something. Vancouver Canucks, Vancouver Whitecaps and BC Lions. Yes, sir. And another mediocre road here. Yep, not what I want. Speak Mandarin. I don't. Are you ever gonna stop moving? Of course, behind a tree. My sports are Dakar Rally to watch and small boar target bench rest shooting. Rated as one of the best shooters in the UK. Awesome Firefox. <laughs> Flinter got an albino spring bug. Gonna get a rare on this stream. Uh, if I wanted to get rares, I'd be running around and checking a lot more tracks than I am now. His felon is just not as good for shooting a lot of animals and such as Wuhunga or Leighton is. Even, even uh, Medford is better. This area is just way too dense with the vegetation. It's so rare you actually have like good visibility for a long period of time. Where are the other ones are pretty much just shooting galleries. Where did this tiny thing go? Could just do a call honestly. Can you hide me? No? Well then don't. Just be down here. Get up here so I can shoot you. Well actually car racing is big here too. Mandarin is a fruit in Denmark. Aren't Danes good at swimming as well? I think we won a medal at the Olympics. Yeah we All did. Right. Tom30 joins the Second Nation right here on YouTube. Thank you so much for subscribing, Tom. That's gonna work. Uh, 
And yet another one just on the small side of being gold. We're done hunting red deers up here. I want to go down here. Um, could shoot some keys? Nah. Asgard is actually going hunting next Saturday. How is everyone doing with real life hunting these days? I'm, I think most of the world has like seasons on for it right now. Elias says, I like Formula 1 and Kimi Reikkonen is the best. Do you hunt in real life, Mrs. Beard? No, but the beard does. He was actually out hunting with Sean, do you understand? How is the videos coming along? By the way, Mrs. Beard? I know he was doing some kind of videos about it. Silver Moon is gonna go elk hunting soon. Where is the bacon? Why didn't I heal up when I was at the hut? <sighs> well, there's the bacon. Oh, they're hunting my moose here, says Sandra. Oh, he's waiting to get even more footage from the next trip. We shot a big male moose here in Umeo. Just da bacon. It's right there. Oh, level three bacon. Even more level three bacon. What? I would love if I could get a decent spot of those guys. See you, luck. I see one bacon level three, I see another bacon level three. And then that one, was it two? So I think there was one more somewhere. Not too happy with the cover I can get here. This might work though. I spent a week hunting recently. I gave up and I finally found the speaker I was hunting for by accident. <laughs> I would pick on Flinter more, but I've picked on him like 5.9 <laughs> times already. So I don't hurt, want to hurt his feelings too much. Why are you running away when I just gave you a call down here? So we've got a bunch of twos and threes, I think. Might as well just shoot at that. One with a... That was one of three as well. It's actually coming in real close right there. Hmm. Gonna have to deal with that one. We have the same as in Hisselton minus the bison. Yeah, that's pretty much the Danish fauna we have right here. And another silver. My uncle shot a massive mule deer and got 80 pounds of meat. It was awesome. That's a lot. Gaming legend, what is up? You know, there is one positive about you being worse than Flinter. I can actually read and participate in the chat without being overwhelmed by nine-year-olds. Aaron, that's not really got much to do with me being worse. That just got 
to do with the fact that he has a four times bigger, three times bigger channel than me. So... I wouldn't say blame that on skills. If anything, I'm way better at YouTube than Flincher is. And um, you can ask him that. That is actually one of the few things he will agree on. I thought that was a wild boar for sure. Emily Barger, what have I missed? Well, played a fun of games, actually. Just had a bit of a <laughs> very, very poor hunt when it comes to trophies so far. Biggest we've seen has been like level 3 wild boars, level 2 brodeus, and level 7 red deers. <laughs> Sportman Channel says, Yeah, but Zaggy Flinter's channel is bigger, but how many of those subs are 9 year olds and multiple accounts? Uh, once you have me beat on Patreon, I will start to be worried. But the second Asian is still the biggest one of the two on Patreon. Mainly because we have... <laughs> we don't have all the nine-year-olds that Flinger has. Which is fine, by the way, guys, but I, I think you actually have to, to be at least 13 to have a YouTube account. <laughs> Where is everything? His felton seems so dull today. Oh, was that something? No, oh, it's just tracks. from an animal that I had already forgotten about. Why did I do a silly little jump right there? I don't think I hit anything. He was actually in here earlier, Wayne Beard was stopping by, but I guess he is busy playing Red Dead Redemption. Yeah, I've locked my life. I, I would still get the tracks of the big animals if there was anything around, so... Running is actually my preferred tactic to get most big animals. All of the above outdoors is back in the chat. Only thing I really, 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 really dislike about um, Norway. Why does everything have to be so expensive, Sandra? Oh, I hit a tree. I actually ran headfirst into a tree. We get paid a lot, lol. But we don't, Sandra. So whenever we come visit you, I, I just feel like paying 90 crowns for a beer is way too much. <sighs> what do we have of tracks here? Anything interesting? Nope. Just the row. I've been listening the whole time, by the way. I've just been hunting the werewolves. Have you gotten any bigger ones than your albino? All of you about? Mm. <laughs> Cookie jar is unsubbing because I'm getting called a nine year old. It's okay, man. Sad to see you go. 
But you gotta do what you gotta do to protect Team Flinter, right? <laughs> Denmark is a lot better than the beer aspect. Cheap beer is cheaper than water in stores. It actually is. That's not even a lie. If you want to buy bottled water, you're easily paying like twice or three times the price of a beer <laughs> in Denmark. Uh, wildlife, what is up? 90 what for a beer? 90 crowns, which is probably like 12, 13 dollars. Have you ever donated, Cookie? If you have, then thank you so much for your generous support throughout the time. <laughs> Sportsman Channel says, Hey, I called you all nine years. Don't unsubscribe from the king. That's right. I will need my old title back in Discord soon. King Zaggy will be right back once October is over. <laughs> Still stuck in the 13th century in Denmark, eh? Beer for breakfast, lunch and dinner. Ah, and, and the nightcap and everything like that. Will Flinter and you go live soon? Nathaniel, I actually asked him to come join me on tonight's stream. But he was apparently busy. Yeah. I asked him to come here and he refused. Oh, we got a big red deer somewhere here. Two twenty one should be an eighth, I think. All of the above, of course you should. Else you never know when you should come here and hate on me. I wonder who can call him in. I see him running right there. We need to get down. It is an eighth mythical. Oh, it's a big boy. I really just want to shoot him to be quite honest because if he gets too close he is definitely just gonna see us and bolt. is big guys and he is dead that is an expensive beer it is no way it's extremely expensive when it comes to beer how long will it be until you have 40,000 subscribers I don't know Probably not as long as Flinter used to get it. That would be my honest answer. At least I don't hope so. There we go. 898. Definitely the biggest animal of the stream. Look at that massive rack on this thing. 219 trophy rating. Wow. There's just something majestic about the red deer. So I just... Definitely my favorite animal in the Hunter Call of the Wild. Let me hear what your favorite animal is in the Hunter Call of the Wild and why. Love to hear that. God rack. I only hate in Discord, not in the live streams. <laughs> Don't shoot from there, you're just stressing me. You're as bad as me, I'm usually shouting at my screen when people are tracking animals. <laughs> oh, that is awesome, guys. Love that you're actually getting into the game as much as that. 
Can I shoot that one in the face from here? I probably could. We'll see if I can get to 150 before we do anything crazy with that thing. Good hunting, man. Thank you so much, Robert Cruz. Thank you for being here. <laughs> Heine Paulson loves Rabbit and Layton. Love the warning call, and they are cute. White-tailed deer. Shoot it in the face. Oh. Should be having about 150 now, I think. What is it doing with its head, though? Is it looking... I think that might be a disabled fox. Gonna try from here. Works. Wildlife just got three diamonds in one day. Nice. Whitetail, always been my favorite deer. Elk, another longtime favorite. And Wildebeest are my favorite, says Sparta Dog. Guys, if you're not yet familiar with Sparta Dog's work, she is posting it in the barbershop once in a while. In the. Is it randomness or is it pictures? I don't remember. But definitely go check her out. She is a very talented artist and does some killer paintings. Is it called paintings? Sketches? I don't know. Whatever it is, they look amazing. Mrs. B says Blacktail. Another. Oh, the consecutive fell off now, just after we harvested the big one. <laughs> that was very convenient for once. This game was actually nice to us. Harley says anything with a rack. <laughs> Put it out of its misery. <laughs> Give it two pains in the neck. I'm clums clumsy enough to have a suitcase drop on my hand. I need some helps. Someone go help Silver Moon. I want to cross here. <laughs> Sportsman Channel says, We don't help crazy cat ladies. Them cats are scary. AF. Oh well, I was right then. Both sketches and paintings. Ezra Crittenden is in the house as well. Thank you for stopping by. Ezra. Yeah, Mrs. B agrees. Spot a dog. They are amazing. They really are. You're talented. <sighs> Let's go up and see if we can get just another big animal to end with. Would be nice to at least get something that would be potential diamond. I saw a herd of something. Let's just run up there and check the tracks. <laughs> Wayne even went and subscribed to Spider Dog. Awesome, man. You should have your like portfolio and such linked to your YouTube channel, though, Spider Dog. Just in case anyone actually goes to your channel when we give you shout outs. Fallow deer. Just new. That seems to be a lot of the female variety. And small females as well. Awesome spotted dog. <laughs> Elk the gamer. 
Went and stopped as well. Nice. Oh my god, the wind is terrible for this. Let's see if we can actually get anything out of this. I love scouting the waterways, you just never know what you're gonna find. And Sandra is actually one of the other, she is a lot more secretive about it, but she is doing some amazing paintings as well. She actually has a link to her art stuff on her YouTube channel, I think. I wish I was talented at that. I I'm not. Um, these days I'm trying to... <laughs> we bought a drawing book for my kid. Just that thing about trying to paint within the lines. Yeah, that, that does not really work too good for me. Funny Zaggy DK, I never lose integrity during a hunt. Never, ever. Well, you probably spend a lot more time taking the shots and doing the things like a real hunter would doing. Where I'm just out here having fun. William Nordbean just hit the subscribe button. Thank you so much, William. Art takes time. Yeah, and I don't have any patience. <laughs> if there's one thing I would actually wish I had... This is wrong, because I do... I am a patient guy. I'm patient in the long term. I cannot be patient in small or in like if there's something right here right now I can't be patient I, I but I'm fine with this I mean just take a look at this YouTube journey I know if it's ever gonna be something that I'm gonna be able to sustain myself with I know it's gonna probably be like five ten maybe even longer if it's ever gonna happen in uh, in years but I'm okay with that I'm patient when it comes to this because I have so much stuff to do around it, but if I just sit down with something and try to be patient, yeah, I can't do that. That, that does not work for me <laughs> at all. Try programming. <laughs> nope, thank you. I'd love to do some art videos someday, but I gotta sort out some mental health crap before I commit to making that work. Yeah, I gotta. Oh my god! I gotta get everything working out before you start doing stuff like that, yeah. Definitely. Ooh, we got bacons. Gotta run away bacon over there. Hmm, I think the biggest one was a three anyway. Not too fast then. Oh, oh. 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 Oh, is that a four? Definitely gonna be worth trying to sneak close on that. Looked pretty decent. I'm impatient when I order food. <laughs> my avatar here is a painting I did of my dog. Nice. My type of art is making tower out of empty beer cans and shoot them with bird shots. <laughs> oh. Sandra Linnea, the queen in here, and Mrs. Beard is our mother. Are you okay with that, Mrs. B? Ernesto is in the house as well. Thank you for stopping by. Oh, that's the right choice then, Silver. Why is it you can never spot the big animals when they're better down? I think it got a spot there. Was it a four? Two. 
took me months, but she said for all oh, three forty-five minutes for me to do a sketch of her. That is awesome, Wayne. Mrs. B is a queen, Sandra. It's the princess. We can work with that. After all, Mrs. B is the old one of the two of you. I mean, she's she's got to be at least close to 30. Oh. That is a very weird looking fellow, dear. But seriously, why can't I get a spot at that thing right there? It's right there. <sighs> well, nothing more to do than actually find a decent place to sit and hide and then do some calling. All right. Evan Rock hit the subscribe button as well. Thank you so much, Evan, for subscribing to the channel and joining the Saggy Nation. Crystal Bjornal, what is up? I think this would work. Seriously, though. Well, I'm gonna do a red deer call as well, just to see if we can actually get any. Yeah, <laughs> the thumbnail fellow was bigger. <laughs> Trick is to point my iPad at my dog, and she think <laughs> it will, t and she will think you're taking her photo, and will sit forever. Oh, nice. I swear to God, these bushes here moves. What is that? Two level six. Well, that's probably just a five. Hmm. This is actually two level six. Oh. Just another the female thing. I don't think I've still gotten a spot. There we go. Four easy. Definitely gonna be the target. I don't have much life, so I need to be somewhat careful that I don't end up getting them all way too close. Not too much, just got home, taking care of a close friend, ended up coning home with a cold. Oh, or coming home with a cold, that sucks. Get better soon. Don't run me over, come on. I'm getting forced to take a shot here, I really don't want to take. It's just gonna be... <sighs> don't, 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 I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. And he stopped. Stop again, please. Now he, of course, walked away. <sighs> he is right there. Oh, 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 no, 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 don't get too close. Move. Get away! Oh my god. <laughs> this is getting too... A little too intense for my likings. Okay, whenever he stops I think we should be golden. Although we do know the consecutive has just fallen off as well, so that's... Perfect. Could you just stop, please? I really don't like any of the angles he's been presenting us with so far. There. No. Okay. Seriously. 
Sean Jones is in the house as well. There's probably a more elegant way to do it, but I went ahead and added my website and social media to the description section on my page. Thanks for the idea. You're very welcome, Smarter Doc. Uh... Did not really feel comfortable doing that, but I did not see any other options. I think we need to go and pick that one up before we get the other one. Made a call from a roadie, that might actually just help us out. Well, what the hell happened right here? <laughs> that is quite interesting. Oh. Touching pressure on this one now too. This should get Zomel off Marvin's back. He'll be relieved. I just did a mission. Nice. <laughs> Interesting. I'll pledge to you on Patreon again next year, just for the month of January, like I did this year. Awesome sportsman channel. Looking forward to having you back. Oh, supposed to have snow. We actually had like the the grass was all white this morning and I was just being like, nope, this is too early. Not having it. And my consecutive actually did fall off again. Perfect. We're gonna have to go and find oh, but that at least means this one died over here somewhere. <sighs> was a road here somewhere down there, but I'm not gonna count on it. I have no idea where the fallow deer went. Really see if we could find the blood of her somewhere. <laughs> yeah, doing missions without knowing you're doing missions is always good. It is! Pretty much the way that I do most of my missions these days. Where did it go though? Take time off, Aaron. We had snow here in some places, but not much. Yeah, we did actually have a little bit of snow somewhere in Dinamarca, I know. I really want to go shoot a one or two more before we end with that. It should be a pretty decent fellow. I'd imagine it being a gold at least. Where the hell? Oh. Wait. Where did all the animals go? Screw it, we're just gonna go and pick it up. Hey Darius. I'm done with this game trolling me for today. We actually have the blood trigger for right here. Funny how me and Saggy both don't work in the winter, but both are very different jobs. Is 
So if we can find it over here, then should bring us up to at least 80%. Oh, a shed. And a wheelbarrow. They all ganged up in the meadow and said the same thing. <laughs> Pick up, thank you. Where's the dead one? Should be dead like right here. No, still not. Miss, did you die somewhere? I do have a warning call from the road here. There she's dead. I hate this game once in a while. Okay, that should bring us up to the 100%. The antler was right here. I had a dead deer right here, which I hit in the skull. <laughs> Jumping. 66 score guys <sighs> well you missed a nearly 900 scoring red deer david gens devin gens even and there we go should be fine to go and pick up our big fellow deer okay let's head back Am I only at 40? Did it reset again? Well, we're not gonna shoot anything more anyway, so we're just gonna... Since we shot the big one, we've picked up three animals, so we should be at 100%. So if we're not, then... Blame expansive worlds. We can always try to figure out how big it would have been anyway. Nice. I'm on the wrong field as well. <laughs> I have no idea, Ernesto. There is docks on console right now, but they seem to be bucked as hell. This game is really hard for me as well because this it is, does seem like it really hates me these days. <laughs> but let's pick it up. A gold, eight hundred and seventy-one score, and this guy's nearly ninety kilos. A fallow deer is going to be the one that we're going to end the stream on. We didn't get a diamond here hunting on his felon, but we've got some pretty nice animals. I'm pretty happy with that. Thank you all for showing your love and support. Thank you, Chased1, for the super chat during the stream. And thank you all for subscribing and being a part of the Sagan Nation. If you're not yet a part of the Sagan Nation on Facebook, there is a link for that in the description below. All else, the only thing left is that I want to invite you all to come join us on Discord. Come hang out, have fun. And just chat along with everyone. See you right there. See you next time. <laughs>